Broccoli salad Ooh. with quiche Lorraine. Um, <clears throat> two things. Um, who is Lorraine? And why does she have a quiche named after her? And two, broccoli, really? Oh, come on, Liana. You know, Broccoli's good. Yeah, broccoli is actually Latin and you for arms. Oh. And these arms have done a lot of work mm. this week. So we're just naming it after you in a way. Uh, yeah, actually, let's do uh, quiche Liana. That. I like that a lot. Quiche Liana sounds good. With broccoli salad. Broccoli. Mm. With Liana. I'm not a big fan of broccoli. Oh. Trust, trust me. Trust us. You're gonna you love it. You will love it, okay? As a matter of fact, we're gonna get into that bit first. Here's the salad. To make your salad, you can use whatever vegetables you like, but here's what we're going with. Broccoli! Salad mix, tomatoes, some feta cheese, almonds, and to make a tasty dressing, we've got one garlic clove, a tablespoon of olive oil, one teaspoon of Dijon mustard, a teaspoon of lemon juice, and some salt and pepper to season. And here's what you do. Step number one is to chop up your garlic and whisk the dressing ingredients and then set them aside. Step two, throw together your salad ingredients. And step three is simply adding your dressing and mix. Easy as. Here's what you'll need to make a quiche liana. We've got three eggs, 50 mils of milk, Two teaspoons of onion jam, half a teaspoon of paprika, 80 grams of cheddar cheese grated, a small handful of parsley, four rashes of bacon finely chopped, salt and pepper to season, and any other five plus a day you've got. We're going with delicious mushrooms and courgettes. And of course, some puff pastry. Now let's put it all together. First up, preheat your oven to 180 degrees Celsius. Step two is to grease your pastry tray. So then what you're gonna do is you're gonna take your pastry, you're gonna place your tin on top of it, cut out a nice circle, and then pull out that pastry and push it inside your dish. Step number three, for the filling, sprinkle bacon over the bottom of the tart face. Step four, it's time to get whisking a whole bunch of your ingredients too. We've got your egg, milk, paprika, your onion jam, add in that parsley, your cheese, and mix it all up. Step five, Pour your egg mixture into the tart case. Don't forget to add in your chopped up five plus a day. And bake it for 25 minutes or until the filling is set. And then you end up with this. Mmm. Okay, this is our way of saying thank you to Craft Queen Liana, so we better go wake her up. Oh, no, 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 no. Liana doesn't like to be woken up, okay? Follow my lead, follow my lead. Okay, um, take a look at her. Okay, quiet. Oh, yeah. Grab it, really gentle. Okay. We're over there. Shh, shh, shh. Your shoes. Make a noise. Okay. Sit next to the table. A little bit more, a little bit more. Close it, close it. Okay. 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 It's working. Quiche Liana with broccoli salad. <laughs> that is the best looking quiche I have ever seen. Not to mention that salad. I mean, it's got broccoli in it, but it's got all sorts in it as well. It's delicious. Would you like to sit on the beanbag or at the table? Um, yeah, how do my, how do my, come up, have a car. Yeah. Wow, wait, thank you guys. This looks absolutely incredible. And you know, <laughs> what I need to do is probably just um, cut that open. I like yeah. that, I like that. Um, so you cut that, and then this part right here, yeah, that goes straight into the gob. <laughs> into the gob. <laughs> Would it be fair to say that this dish is fit for a queen? I am eating it, Walter, and it is delicious. Yes, it is! It's absolutely amazing. The um, salad is so tangy and delicious, and it's like, 
Mm. And the broccoli. broccoli tastes good. Yes. It tastes, it tastes good. We'll get, we're glad you love it, Niana. Oh, and the quiche. Oh, it's absolutely sensational. Now all you need to do is subscribe by clicking here.